What's up, guys? My name is Levi. I am from Shred Shop in Cochrane, Alberta. And these are the Nija Houston Pro Free Shoes in Bleached Coral. So JT and I bleached our hair to stand in solidarity with the coral. So we're always coming out with new content, reviewing products, doing how-tos. If you want to follow us along in the journey, hit the subscribe button below and you'll constantly be linked to the new videos. This is Nija's first pro model shoe with Nike that he designed. It has been so well received and this color is fire. So the colorway is based super closely off nigiri sushi. If you know anything, that's salmon sitting on top of rice. So we got the rice colorway, we got the salmon and a little bit of wasabi resembling a good penis of sushi. So you pull out the insoles, they've got a cool connecting graphic on there. If you know, if you go out for sushi, you see the chopsticks, the soy sauce, and that dish is a pretty common pattern that's on a lot of the, the soy sauce dishes. And on the heel of this one, it says Nija in some super weird, maybe fake Asian writing. And so comment below if you're triggered by that and you think Nija's a racist. So another thing you notice about these insoles is that they're actually super, super thin. I have a couple pair of the Nike free running shoes and it's the same thing, so not to worry. All the tech is in the sole, the impact, the form fitting, the flexibility, the tech is in the sole. Always money in the banana stand. No touching. No touching. No. It has the Nike SB free sole, which right out of the box has a ton of flexibility, but good durability. It's a really good out of the box, skatable cup sole. A couple cool details you have about the shoe is you have the pull strap here for an extra style. And then when you flip it to the inside, all of his shoes have this drop down pop color. Some of them is an off color, but on this one it matches. And again, I have some Nike free running shoes, same sort of thing. So it plays off of that, but brings it into skateboarding, making it super steezy. So if you followed his career, you know that he had the dopest dreads and now he has fluffy hair. What do you believe? Should he have cut off his dreads or not? Comment below. So you'll notice when you go to put your foot in, it's a little bit tougher because it's so tight, but the nice thing about it, it has this internal sleeve, which basically works out like a full sock liner. The tongue is attached. And if you pull back one side, you can see there's uh, some thread there that kind of looks like a fly wire design that holds the laces in, but also when your foot goes in, it flexes and hugs all the way around it, keeping your heel back and keeping your shoe snug, making it feel like a slip on. So as always with these Nigel Free shoes, it's a full like rubber tech material on top, making it super grippy, super durable and super lightweight. You'll also notice in the color, there's a little bit of a green fleck in there, adding it for a little bit more dimension. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Levi, I'm from Shred Shop. That's shredskateshop.com. I'm from Cochrane, Alberta. These are the Nike free pro shoes. They are so sick. Like and subscribe below. Get it. <laughs> Anomalous, gutless, coward. Nobody knows who the hell he is or she. But for the sake of our national security, the New York Times should publish his name at once. I think their reporters should go and investigate who it is. That would actually be a good scoop.